All right, everybody, we're back here with some more franchise. I'm going to continue on after that horrendous loss from last time. Matt, oh, really? Oh, piece of crap. Oh, he's back. All right, cool. Q. All right, Jose Fernandez. All right, let's go. Play the Astros. Hello, baseball fans. Before Thursday's action gets kicked off, let's recap what went down around the league on when. Shut up. Damian White. Broken leg. That's bad. Uh, it's... All right. All righty. Make sure they didn't screw up the lineups. Yeah, they look pretty good. All right. Let's go. <clears throat> Start this game up. Looks like the Astros are good at hitting, but uh, not very good at pitching, it looks like. Well, how's my batting so pretty decent? Jeez. Freaking suck at hitting. Still got a long way to go until the end of the season. My goodness. to start skipping every two weeks soon looking like a great afternoon for baseball at Minute Maid Park All Yankee right, baseball go. starts now D Gordon will step to the All plate right, now as we're go. ready to get this one underway <laughs> uh, as a sinker underway oh. now in the Sunday finale as the first pitch today is taken for strike one EK, as we take a look at our home nine as they take the field here this afternoon, they'll look to make it three straight here as they come in on the heels of two straight wins. And after losing the opener of this series on Thursday... Oh, no. How dare you. Straight. Get there, D. Oh. Oh. And a good three. Throw gets him one gun. Eric Ibar will stand in for the first time now, hoping to break out of this little six-game dry spell at the plate. Drops Darn in a strike it. to start the at bat. Nothing in one. It's so important with guys like this to get ahead with strike one. Put them behind in the count and on their back. Oh, right man. Away. Bases are empty. One man out. Now here it comes. Down and away. It's a ball and two strikes. The one, two. Here's a ground ball to Take Dang. it onto the bag himself. Two gone now here in the first. Andrew McCutcheon will get his first opportunity here. And he enters play third in the American League batting race. Here's the pitch. Swing and a ball. Boom. Well hit out towards yes. left center. Good and hit. Into the gap and should be extra bases. And this will find the wall out near the visitor's bullpen. Not in time. And he's in there with a double. Giancarlo Stanton will dig in now. One home run shy of 20 for the season so far. Down and away, one ball and no strike. All of a sudden, you got to be careful now with the cleanup guy up there with a runner in scoring position. He could oh, be yeah. Taste that garbage. Freaking drop it. Drop it. And nothing will uh. come of the two out double as the inning is Dang over. Dang it. Come on, let's get this freaking over with. This training is sucks. All right. Christian Yelich. We'll step in now to lead things off in the home half of the first. And a change up here misses off the corner to start him out. It's ball one. EK, as we take a look at our visiting club as they take the field here in this scoreless ball game. They were losers last time out, but still in a decent groove as they'd won four or five prior to that. Yeah, they still find themselves stuck in third place yes. in the division, but 
This is an important stretch for these guys, and if they can string a few victories together, they've got a chance to get back into it. And he'll indeed make the play in foul territory for the first down. Scooter Jeanette will get his first opportunity here, and as you can see, he's got that average up over the 290 Spot. mark to begin play. Now here's the pitch. Swinging a ball here on the ground, but this will wind up a foul ball, strike two. Here comes Fernandez, 0-2. And he gets a uh -huh. piece here as this ball is fouled away. Here comes another 0-2. Way outside. One and two. Four pitches. Fast, slow, fast, slow. EK, you thinking fastball here? It seems to fit the pattern, but you better not get too predictable out there. Guys will catch on quick. Oh. Good take that time on a low breaking ball. Two and two now. Well, I'd be surprised if they go back to the curve again on two and two. He's had a couple of pretty Dang good it. looks at it. Full count. Three and two. 3-2, here it comes. And here's a ball. Oh, come on. Uh, you lucky piece of crap. Base hit. Anthony Rizzo will get his first shot now with the runner at first following the one-out single. And that misses low and away, ball one. That change up away is his ground ball pitch. That's a good Dang. job to hold off. And a fastball there is inside as that one backed him up a bit. Rizzo out in front here as this is pulled foul into the seats and right. Runners on first with one down. Uh, could have been three and one. Instead, it's two and two. And you figure to see that change up more and more as this day uh. progresses. And the first time through the lineup, you want these guys to know that. Uh oh, hold that thought. As Come on, is man. Down the line in left. Hooking, but it's a uh, run. Seriously? A two-run shot off the bat of Anthony Rizzo. Home run number 16 for him on the year. And the Astros have taken a two-to-nothing lead. And oh, Jones come takes on, this one for dude. A ball, one and one. Can't get them to swing at anything. The pitch. Inside here with the hard uh, stop. It's two and one now. Now here's the pitch. He's fallen behind now. Three this and is one. garbage. Well, he just hasn't been able to find any kind of groove out there. Hasn't oh my god! Hit his spots, and now at three and one, he's put him in yet another great hit. Jesus comes on with one away as he looks at a ball. It's one and zero. Oh. Well, he's really had to work hard here in this first inning. You gotta wonder how much is that gonna take out of him. And he comes back with a fastball. Move this one stupid thing at the Very top. Can't to freaking see the bar. Maybe even a little too patient because now he's down one. Uh, and I don't think he's gonna get anything better than that to hit. Swinging a ball hit on the ground, but a foul ball as it holds it two and two. The two two one more time. And he oh misses come this one on! Inside, and that'll run things full three and two. Now the question, do you send the guy on three and two with one out? And sorry to hear the play has been made for the third out, inning over. Starling Marte will dig in, and this season certainly hasn't been all that kind to him as he enters play with the oh average down in the 230s. No contact on the sinker there, and he's behind 0-1. Pitch on the way. Swing hard liner to left center. And that's a base hit. Yoenis Cespedes will come forward now. Back in the lineup here after getting yesterday afternoon off. Now a ball hits sharply toward third. And this is going to be a fair ball as it'll head to the corner. Long throw to third. And he is in there. Nice. Manny Machado. Will stand in and his guys have got something cooking now with two on and nobody out and down by two this is a good opportunity to try to put yourselves level and he gets under this one and in fact breaks his bat as this one dang it up. and he will somehow keep his eye on the baseball there as he has it for a big out number one Matt Adams 
Smith will dig in now. He had a couple of hits in yesterday's contest. First pitch here is a sinker that runs a bit too wide. It's ball one. All right, you're down two here. You've got the tying runs and scoring position. In the dirt and blocked behind the plate. And he'll get back in safely as wisely he hadn't committed too strongly toward third base. Here's the 2 0. And this is hit hard on the ground at first. Throw to the plate. The tag oh, the come on. But wisely, no thought of a return throw, and the inning will continue. Jared Salta Lamacchia will stand in, and you see what he's done over the past seven games. Boy, arctically cold. Dang first it! Hack in here, and that's the first strike. There's not a whole lot of conviction in that swing. It was almost like an afterthought, like an emergency hack. Oh my and God! Lamacchia Come on! Right in the hole now, down 0 and 2. And you kind of get the sense that he's not really. Here's a breaking ball blocked by Avila. Good job to corral this quickly as the runners hold on. Here's the one, two. Swing and a ball hit hard on the ground. Oh, on to oh my and God. Threat goes by the boards as the inning is over. Alex Avila will stand in now as he was reinserted back into the lineup here after taking a needed day off yesterday. Swing and a miss on the slider. Nothing in one. Off the plate, one ball, one strike. Now the pitch. And now a fastball, but he's able to This is such garbage. Why don't they swing at anything other than when it's in the freaking zone? He can still work the count. That alone can be beneficial to an offense. And he oh takes my God! Leadoff man aboard here to begin the uh, second. Uh, will stand in now, following leadoff walk, and might we see a bunt attempt here in the two-run ball game? Every extra run helps. It's a possibility, but I think they'll probably let him take his chances swinging away. That's in there, and he's deep in the hole now, 0 and 2. Here comes Fernandez, 0 and 2. I'll never the outside. It's freaking one never yeah. after that last swing I would have thought they'd go right back in but that's actually not a bad location because I doubt he was looking for something out there Ball two. to two balls and two strikes now he's set now the pitch and this ball is also hit foul and heading for the seat so we'll have to do it again annoying. still two and two and he just manages oh to stay God. alive here as he fights this one foul. Here comes a 2-2. Now he turns on a fastball here and sends it to deep right field. Therefore, it is Stanton, and he's got it for the first out. Andres Guardado will dig in for the first time here, looking to change his fortunes a bit as he's seen that average dip these last four or so games. First pitch is a changeup for a called strike. He's set, now the pitch. And he drops that one in for strike two. Yeah, he came with a little bit of a different look that time. This pitch is also in there knee high, and now they've got him behind in the count, 0-2. Under it now is Stanton to make the catch, and there are two away now. Two. Danny Valencia will stand in now. Two hits in five trips for him in yesterday's ball game. And here's a fastball called for strike one. And against a guy like this, you're usually only going to get one pitch to hit in that bat. Sometimes you might not even get that, so that's one he may want back. And this one's in the dirt. But fortunately here, no advance. Here comes a one-two. Now a swing and a ground ball. But this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at one and two. Again, a one-two. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. He's ready now, the pitch. Now a hard hit ball back up the middle. And that'll get through into center field for a base hit. This is ridiculous. Christian Yelich. We get a shot now with two on and two out here in inning number two. Fastball in there for a cold strike. From the belt, the pitch. 
And a check oh, swing here as he couldn't help himself, and it's ruled strike two. He's ready. Now the pitch. Not a bad pitch there with two strikes, but it misses one and two. Pause. Now the pitch. That misses, and we're even at two and two. Now this needs to be a strike here on two and two because of not. Oh, sorry to interrupt, but that's Finally. the third strike oh and the third <laughs> out. Side is retired. D. Gordon is ready to go here as we begin the third. Second baseman. D. First offering on the way. Tried to Dude, golf at it, but it's he like that ball freaking gets uh, camouflage in the background. Here comes. And here's a curveball in the dirt that time for a ball. One and one. Ready now on one and one. Now a ball lined toward right center. And he is going to reach. It's a base hit. Eric Ibar will stand in now, and he'll likely have a look down to third to see if anything's up here with nobody out. But the runner's back easily. Here's the first offering. First pitch curveball runs in a bit too tight. It's ball one. And you figure now this would be a spot where that man might try to take second base. And it wouldn't be a bad idea to hold the ball a little longer out there on the mound. Really vary your times to the plate. You can't be predictable out there or he'll take advantage. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw way nice. late. And he's in there easily at second. Here's the 1-1. One, one. And he throws the cutter right by him to take control one and two. For Gordon, stolen base number 20 for him on the year. Misses, ball two. A runner at second, nobody out. Sets the 2-2 pitch. And this is hit well towards the hole. And he's retired one away. Andrew McCutcheon will stand in here. He doubled his first time around. Now the first pitch. A fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. Any thought to bring in the infield in here with one away? Still a little early in my book. A run you can live with. What you don't want to do is let this snowball into a big inning. And wow, that looked to be well inside, but it's a called strike. Two and one now. That's a great call there on two and oh. The whole world's thinking fastball, but they dropped the hammer on it. And this is swung on and bounced on the ground to third. Throw to first is in Dang time, it. but meanwhile, the runner is in to score. Giancarlo Stanton try and start over now with the bases empty and two away following the RBI ground out. Here's the pitch. On he goes down and lines this one into left field. A base hit. Starling Marte will stand in. A base hit his first time around. Now here's the first pitch. Breaking ball for a strike. 0-1. Oh From the belt. Kicks and deals. Swung on and hit deep to left center. This one has a chance. Nice. And there we go. I needed that. So a two-run shot to left center. Home run number five on the year. As the Yankees move out in front here, it's now three to two. Yoenis Cespedes is at the plate as he watches ball one. The 1-0 pitch. Right on, but this is foul down toward the box at third. The 1-1. One, one. That's in there on the outer half. One and two now. Now the 1-2. And he'll lay off the curveball that's in the dirt that time, and it's back to even now at two and two. Yeah, and on one and two, when you know the guy at the plate needs to protect, that's a great spot for that. And oh, we'll have to leave it there. Overthrown. made here to end the inning. But they strike for three in the inning. Two on this two-run home run. Bottom of the third coming up. And New York has taken a three-to-two lead. Now the first pitch. 
he couldn't get on top of it as this has popped up behind shortstop. Ibar is there to make the catch, and it's one pitch, one gone here in the bottom of the third. Anthony Rizzo will try things again. He hit that two-run homer his first time. Fouled straight back. Third inning, already a 3-2 ball game. Now here's the pitch. That almost got him. It's a ball and a strike. I'll say this. He wasn't going to get his arms extended on that one. Fouled back. The right-hander deals on one and two. And a swing nice. and a miss as they caught him reaching that time, and there are two away. Adam Jones will dig in. Drew a walk his first time around. And a high strike there, 0-1. Well, we've mentioned it already, but look at the pitch count here in the third inning. He's almost completely out of gas already. And Machado will make the catch here, and that ends the inning. Manny Machado will stand in now to get us going here in the fourth. First pitch coming. In there, 0-1. And the pitch. Reaches down and hits this one on the ground to short. Throw to first in time. One gone here in the fourth. Matt Adams will stand in. He reached on a fielder's choice his first time. First pitch coming. And here's a swing and another chance out there is short. On to first and that is two quick outs to start the fourth. Well, this looks to be a very oh, bad darn. situation here as he's in a lot of pain <laughs> in his left arm. And unfortunately, I don't think we can expect to see him back on the field anytime too soon. The catcher, number 39. So bases are empty here with two gone. And coming up, the switch hitting backstop, Jared uh. Sarkisia. Now a swing, and oh boy, ground balls have ruled the inning. A third straight right here. James Loney is going to come on as a defensive replacement now as he takes over at first base. Jesus Batista is in to start things off here as he looks at a called strike. It's nothing in one. And oh, he can't get out of the way of that one. So the leadoff man will be on to open the frame. Alex Avila will stand in. He drew base on balls his first time. Here's a swing and a ground ball. Ibar for one. On to yeah. first. And it's a double play. The second they've hit into in these first four innings. And there are two away now. And here's the first pitch. Gregory Polanco will stand in for the second time now as he looks at a called strike. It's nothing in one. And I think now you're starting to get the sense that he's put that first inning behind him, and he looks a lot more comfortable out there now. Fernandez readying the 1-1. On ah, and he took something off of it there. It's 1-2. One, one of the things that makes him so tough to hit, the ability to put his pitches right on the black. Yeah, I mean, you watch the catcher's glove on some of these, and it literally does not move. That's how good his stuff is. Now another 1-2. Two and two now with two away and the base is empty. We're in the fourth. Three to two is our score. I'll try to bury one down and away, but it's full count now. Three and two. Now a swing and a hard hit grounder. But this will get foul, so they'll do it again. Three and two. Here's the three two pitch. And he looks at one that misses, and that's an excellent job of making his man throw a lot of pitches as he toughs out a walk. First pitch to him. Andres Guardado is in with two away now as he looks at a called strike one. Now you've got the tying run over at uh. first, two away. He's going to be looking to try and find a gap right here and bring that guy all the way around to score. Just lucky to make contact on that one as it's chopped foul. One, two. Now a swing and a softly hit ground ball. But this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at one and two. He'll try again, one, two. And a swing and a ball hit foul heading for the seats. So another foul ball here and it remains one and two. Breaking ball there is down. Good job of laying off. It's back to two and two. From the stretch. 
look out. Don't want to hit him there. It's full three and two. I'll tell you, he's already hit one guy, and he is not afraid to work inside. No, and, and as much as I hate to say it, pitchers have just as much right to the inside part of the plate as you do. The next three, two. Swing and a bouncer out in front. And as it turns out, the two-out walk doesn't come around to haunt him. My as God, that where are you at 80-some pitches? Wow. D. Gordon will dig in one for two he grounded out the first time and followed that with a base hit in his second plate appearance swing and a ball hit softly on the ground but a foul ball here oh and one now the pitch swing and a miss here and he's behind in the count now oh and two yeah and it seems like he kind of got away from that pitch here in the last few innings you got to think about bringing that one right back Pitch in the dirt is swung on and missed, so he'll need uh. to get the force at first. Throw on to first is in time to get him, so that'll go down as a strikeout and a two to three put out for route number one. Now here's the first pitch, and here's the first pitch curveball that bounces on him there. It's ball one. Here's the 1 0. Here's one for Jeanette, the second baseman. On to first, and Feldman's on a roll now, two away. Andrew McCutcheon will dig in. One for two, including a double back in the first. Line hard into left. And he dives to oh, make jerk. a spectacular catch. What a play there to end the inning. Danny Valencia will step in now to lead off the inning as his guys look to maybe break the rut they've been stuck in. Yeah, and after that first inning, it's been all zeros since. And once he kind of got settled into that groove, He's been a difficult nut to crack. And this is going to find the crowd down the left field line. It's a ball and a strike. Here's the 1-1 pitch. Changes up on him, but that's in the dirt for a ball. Here's the 2-1 pitch. Just off the end of the bat, it's a foul ball, and he'll stick around. Here he comes on 2-2. Two and two. And, oh, look out! Up and in and nearly took his head off. Yeah, he's not trying to hit him, I don't think. But sometimes you need to keep guys honest up there. I think that's Come all on. he's trying to do. Ah. And this is into the alley and ought to be good for extra bases. And he's in there safely. He's got a double. Christian Yelich will get a chance now following the leadoff double. And being a left-handed hitter, will at least have a chance to pull one on the ground. Get that tying run over to third base with just one out. He waits. Now the pitch. Swing and a hard hit ball towards oh, the hole. Oh, come on. And a reach, but it's by him as he couldn't quite get to that ball. And they'll put the brakes on at third. Runners at the corners with nobody out. Scooter Jeanette will stand in now with two on here and nobody out to begin the inning. And on the mound, he hasn't found himself in too many rough spots so far. So this might be his first real test of the ball game. The 1-0. And now a pitch hit sharply on the ground, but a foul ball. Can't play. I already have to put someone in already. Now the one and one pitch. In there, one and two now. And some action out in the Yankee bullpen now as a right-hander starts to loosen up. Outside and low that time. Now it's two balls and two strikes. Got to say, for a strikeout pitcher, not too many strikeouts here so far. And he's in a big need of one right here. It would definitely come in handy. Are you serious? Oh, he whips on it at first. It's right by him into right. And that lead disappears with it. And this is now a 3-3 ball game. Anthony Rizzo will try it again. He homered back in the first inning of this one. Took a little off, and it's in for a called strike one. A little bit low that time, maybe outside as well. And he continues to labor here, coming up on a hundred pit. Oh, and oh my God! And got away and ended up hitting him. So he'll head down to first on the hit by pitch. Adam Jones will get a shot here in a bases loaded situation, and you'd have to say they've got the right man for the job up here. Yeah, team leader in RBIs. He's got a shot to push that lead out even further if he can come through here. And Jones takes this one for a ball, one and one. A one and one now to Jones. Change Dude, I cannot strike him out. He 
set. Now the pitch. Now a ball fouled down the right field line out of play, so that'll move the count to two and two now. The 2-2 two -two coming now to Jones. This ball's grounded foul. The 2-2 two -two one more time. And a bouncing ball foul. Here's another 2-2. Two -two. In the air to center. Catch made in center. Here comes the runner from third. And the go-ahead runs in to score on the sack flies. This is now a 4-3 ball game. Jesus Batista will get another shot. Hit by a pitch his last time. And this one's down off the shoe tops. 1-0. Now with runners at the corners, up by one with one away, but some managers, they will at least consider the possibility of a hit and run here. Stanton there to take it. Here comes the runner from third. And they'll tack on an insurance strike with the sack fly as they lead now 5-3. to three. Alex Avila will get another shot. He hit into a double play his last time. Curveball looked at here for strike one. Well hit, but I think he pulled it a bit too much. It's a foul ball. Pitch on its way to Avila. And a good two-strike pitch, but he misses high one and two. Could be that that high fastball there was just a setup pitch. Now you've kind of established that high sight level. Could be a good time to break off. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. Now the Astros have somebody up in the bullpen as a right-hander has started to warm up out there. Here's the first offering. Giancarlo Stanton is at the plate now, and he's quickly behind 0-1. Yeah, and he's really getting over the top of that curveball. Cutter low, one and one. Well, you know, if there's anybody in this lineup capable of getting a rally started, this is the guy right here. Oh, and come this on. is going to be fouled into the diamond level seat. Here comes the one, two. This is offered at in the dirt for strike three. Just needs to make that easy throw to first. And the throw will indeed take care of him for the first out. Starling Marte will stride in, but first we take you back to the third as you take another look here at his two-run homer that had him rolling early on. First pitch has him dancing to avoid it. It's ball one. If there's one thing base dealers don't like, it's when you throw at their legs. Now that's their meal ticket you're messing with. And he comes back with one in there for a high strike. 1-1 one, one on the way. And did he go around? No, he did not. Ball two. And you know, sometimes when you're thinking fastball, you try to get moving just a little bit early. And that's a good job of recognizing off speed and then holding back on the swing. Here's the two and two offering. And that's in there for a called third strike on the split fingered fastball, two away. Yoannis Cespedes will stand in here hoping to at least put a ball in play here this inning. There's a drive high in the air and deep to left center field. That one is out of here. A <laughs> home run into the left center field bullpen. A solo home run here off the bat of Yoenis Cespedes. Number 10 for him on the year. As they pull within one here, it's now a 5-4 game. Here's a 1-0. Good team. Now, pitch on the way. 1-1 one, one pitch is a sinker taken for a strike one and two. Now you can't look for a specific pitch. You just got to protect the plate. The one-two. And a breaking ball swung on and missed, and the side is retired. Gregory Polanco will be the batter as we get things going in the bottom of the sixth. Right fielder. Denny Farquhar will come on now as he'll start out the bottom of the sixth. Gregory Polanco will lead things off here for Houston as they look to get things started in this sixth inning. Bottom three in the batting order here as the first pitch misses to the number seven hitter. It's ball one. Out of play off to the right. It's one and one. Here's the one one pitch. Down low, two balls and a strike. The pitch. 
Oh, and not an easy pitch to lay off of, but he did somehow, and he's got it to three and one. One thing that man right there will not tolerate, leadoff walks. Oh, you stupid right moron. This might be a quick outing if that happens. And that gets what the, the right as he starts the inning out here with a leadoff single. Not in time, and he's in there with a double. Here's the first pitch to him. Andres Guardado is in for the third time now as he takes a called strike. It's 0-1. Curveball close, but it's 1-1. He's ready now, the pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. Here's the one, two. Now about a 58-foot breaking pitch that he wisely lays off here. Two, two. Swing and a line drive. Foul. Hits are even at seven apiece. Now another two, two. And he just gets a piece there as this is chopped foul. The 2-2 two -two coming. Now a cutter, but that's in the dirt for a ball. Wow, what an at-bat he's having right now. He's fought off some tough pitches. He's laid off a few pitches like that one. And now he's worked his way back to a 3-2 and two count. Payoff pitch coming. And this will find the seats behind the first base dugout. Full count offering on its way. Now here's a fastball up that he sends in the air out to fairly deep center field. Catch made out there in right center as the runner will tag from second. And he'll make it up to third safely here with one away. Danny Valencia will stand in. Two hits in two trips thus far. There's the cut fastball, but it's low, 1-0. and oh. And now with that runner on third and one away, you need to stay smart at the plate, realizing that they might be working around you to put you on. So you can't go up there chasing some pitches out of the zone. Now a cut fastball finds the target, two and one. Come set, now the pitch. Now a swing and a ball lofted down the right field line and fairly deep. And that will get down as he delivers a big one here. It's a base hit. And he will make it up to second as he advances on the throwing miscue. My goodness. <sighs> Christian Yelich will get another crack. One for three thus far. Low for ball one. Well, you see there on the graphic, he's at second with his ninth two-base hit of the year. Now a ball lined toward the gap in left center. Oh, and a fine play there as he ranges back to put this one away. Not an easy play by any means, and there are two gone. First pitch coming. Scooter Jeanette is at the plate here as he quickly finds himself down a strike. It's 0-1. Big swing there as it's hit pretty well out toward deep left. Oh, come on! I'm tired of that stupid feeling errors! Come on! The score moves to 7 4 now. Anthony Rizzo will come forward now in an RBI opportunity he probably didn't think he'd have. Yeah, it certainly didn't look like he'd have one, but now's where you really have to make teams pay. Nothing will demoralize a team in the field quite like having two out errors that lead to runs. The 1-1 home. Hard hit towards center. McCutcheon is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. James Loney will come on, and as he's newly entered into the ballgame, he'll get his first plate appearance now here in inning number seven. Some action out in the bullpen. Couple of right-handers starting to loosen up. Too high that time with the inning's first pitch. It's ball one. In tight with the sinker. Ball two. Now the 2-0. Just got a piece of it as it's fouled back. Here comes the 2-1. Well struck but foul over by the coaching box. Now the 2-2 pitch. And he tries to get him to reach for it, but it stays outside. Three and two. And this is a nice job so far out of that number eight hole. Taking some pitches, trying to get on, leading off the inning. And a good take there as they'll have a leadoff man aboard to start the seventh. It's ball four. Jared Saltalamacchia will stand in now in what could be a real make-or-break situation. 
And you think at this point, you have to get something out of this end. The further you get into that bullpen, the tougher it's going to be to claw back from this deficit. D. Gordon will dig in now, and he'll do so representing the tying run. Yeah, and you're not too worried about this guy jumping the yard on you here and tying the ball game. But if he does find a way to get on base, things get a whole lot more interesting. A couple of righties starting to loosen now in the bullpen. Has a look, now the pitch. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. <clears throat> a look here at the hits per side here in the late going. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. And one thing you can't do here, you cannot lose him and load the bases. He's still got a couple pitches to play with, but I'd expect this one to be somewhere in the strike zone. The 3-1. And I don't think that's what he wanted to do as the bases are loaded now with still nobody out. Eric Ibar will step in now in a big spot here in a game as close as this one. And a chance at redemption, too, because he hasn't done much through his first three plate appearances. But he could make up for all of that with a base hit right here. Just does manage to get a piece there as this is bounced foul. He set, now the pitch. A swing, and he pops him up on the infield, and the infield fly rule will be in effect here. Andrew McCutcheon will step in now with the possible tying run on first as they try to claw their way back in this thing. And a check oh, swing looked like he went on. around. Yes, indeed, says the first base umpire. Strike one. Pause, now the pitch. And he pumps the fastball by him at 94. It's 0-2. Now with two strikes, he can put the ground ball on the back burner and really go after the strikeout. And this is hit sharply on the ground toward the hole. And that'll just sneak past his outstretched arm, a base hit. And that'll score the run from third. And don't look now, but the lead's cut to two here. Giancarlo Stanton will dig in here with the bases loaded now and a chance to really do some damage. He's been tough to deal with this year. He's second on the team in RBI, so this is a golden opportunity. And he'll power in a fastball that time at 94 for strike one. This guy's been in situations like this so many times before. He's got plenty to call on upstairs to try to help him work out of this jam. Swinging a ball hit on the ground. He's ready. Now the pitch. And he couldn't get him to chase the 0-2 fastball. It's 1-2. and two. Yeah, And he didn't want that one to be in the strike zone. Even with the bases loaded, this is still a strikeout situation, remember. And that's taken outside for a ball, so he's worked it back to 2-2 two and two now. All right, no more hoping he's going to chase. On 2-2 two and two now, you got to come up with your best pitch right here because this is a definite strikeout situation. Off-speed pitch in the dirt as he takes it for a ball. <clears throat> 3-2 pitch. And this is... What? Are you serious? He swings right through it. Are you... Oh, you got to be kidding me. Starling Marte will dig in. He homered back in inning number three. Oh, this game is making me freaking so irritated right now. First pitch on the way. Now a fastball to start things out. Didn't miss by a lot, but it's 1-0. Here at the plate, you just need to be thinking base hit here. A grand slam, that'd be sweet, but a single should be enough to tie up this game. Now some action out in the Houston bullpen as it appears both a lefty and a right-hander are up to throw. Here comes the 2-0. Outside, 3-0 now. The alarm bells are ringing now. They're getting louder and louder, too. Here it comes, the 3-0. Oh, and it misses ball four, <coughs> and that will force home a run. Joanna Cespedes will stand in yet again as we flash you back to the middle innings. This was a turning point here, a solo home run that was really one of the key at-bats of the ball game to this point. Up and in here as he had to bend out of danger. Oof. I'll tell you, you do not want to buzz this guy's tower. And a fastball in the dirt that's taken for a ball. Now the pressure will really start to mount out there. That strike zone's going to feel like it's the size of a soup can. 
And wow, that looked to be well inside, but it's a called strike. Two and one now. Yeah, definitely taken all the way. Not a bad idea with the bases loaded. Here's the 2 1 pitch. Now a swing and a hard oh, come on. Throw on the second for the force, and the side is retired. Adam Jones will stand in. He drove in a run with a sack fly his last time. First offering on the way. And oh, look out. It's the cutter ring. Why are the pitches so off this game? I think he took a little exception to that location. Yeah, and so would I if I was Nowhere down. where I want it to be. That's fine. But once you get up over the letters and closer to my head, now nah, we're talking about a different story. Here he comes on two and one. Takes that one a little bit low. Three balls and a strike now. Uh, need a shutdown inning. A leadoff walk's not on the agenda. You better bear down right here. The three-one coming. A late swing here as this is hit hard to the right side. And he'll take this to the bag. Three unassisted for the first out. And it looks like the Yankees will have a left-hander up and throwing in the bullpen. Jesus Batista comes on with one gone here as he looks at a cold strike one. Pitch on the way. That's taken for a ball. And yeah, it's one and one that now ball, to the Astros right fielder. Now here's the pitch. Just oh, a touch on. inside. Perhaps it's two and one. Now here it comes. A late swing here as this is hit hard to the right side. But this will be a foul ball as that evens things at two and two. High bar at short. And he's oh. safe at first as he beats this one out by about a half a step. Hold on here, though. You can see the skipper heading out of the dugout now, so that very close safe call might be challenged. Yeah, Matt, definitely a close play right there as we're going to get another look at it right here. Boy, that's just nah, so tough safe. to tell for sure from that replay. And we're going to have to see what the Come word on. from the dugout is. Remember, the ruling on the field is safe. Here's the catcher, Alex Avila. Runner goes for second. Pitch is high. The throw, not in time. He's in there at second. Uh. Pitch on its way to Avila. Now a pitch swung on and hit to the left side. But this is going to find the seats of foul ball. Now the 1-1. And a fastball swung on and hit to second. On to first, and there were two down. Gregory Polanco will dig in with a very important insurance run 90 feet away at third. And a curveball drops in there for strike one. Not a bad idea to take a look at that one there. Now that you've seen the curveball, you can start to get a better gauge on it. Get a feel for what it looks like coming out of the pitcher's hand. And that swung on and fouled straight back. Here comes a 1-2. Now a fastball, but that's easy to lay off, and it's back to even at 2-2. Two and two. He waits. Now the pitch. Oh, here's a line drive in the center field. Oh, it's a base on. hit. Coming in to score is the runner from third, and they've pushed it to two here in the seventh. Andres Guardado will try and keep things going now with the runner at first following the RBI single. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw. He skips in, and he's safe. Close play, but he's in there. From the belt, kicks and deals. And low, it's a ball. I'm and getting strike. so tired of this game. Eight runs and even ten hits. No errors in the ball game for the Astros to this point. Freaking now a swing me. and a softly hit ground ball. Throw on to the first baseman Loney. And My the God! When I play MLB, so I get extremely irritated. When no I play Madden, and most of the time I have fun. Now Albuquerque will come on in relief here. This game's completely game freaking random. On the year so far. Now action in the bullpen as their closer starts to get loose out there. Manny Machado is at the plate now, and he takes a cold strike. Boy, they've done a really good job against this guy so far, and it's the first time in the series that they've held him without a hit. Out in front as he grounds this one to short. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up any number eight. James Loney will stride in. He walked and came around to score his first time. Here's the first offering. 
And he takes ball one. Six runs, nine hits. And one error on the Yankee line score so far. The 1-0. 2-0 now. Here's the pitch. And there's the first strike, 2-1. Ready with the 2-1. Good fastball that time as he's pulled the count back to even now. It's 2-2. Two and two. And that's about where he'll sit with that fastball. 93, 94. And that's plenty hard enough to blow up by guys when you need to. And the slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. Crowd gets up for the 3-2. Now a hard <laughs> liner towards short. But unfortunately, right after shortstop for the second out. Jared Saltalamacchia will stand in as they're quickly down to their final four outs tonight. Now the first pitch. And here's a slider that runs inside that time, and that'll keep him from diving out over the plate. You don't want guys to get too comfortable up there, so that's a good idea to run something in tight. And a strike to even the count. One and one. Here comes the one-one. And he takes ball two, and it's two and one. A 2-1 offering. A swing and a miss there, 2-2. Two and two. And sometimes you got to cut down a little stride against a guy who's throwing this hard. Either you take that leg kick completely out of the... And hold that thought as that's a strikeout for out number three. So the inning will come to an end. Ah, uh, Danny what? Valencia will dig in. He doubled home a run last time around. Fastball, whoa, look out. That just about got him in the coconut. Now here's the pitch. And he can't get out of the way there. So the leadoff man will be aboard to open up the inning. Christian Yelich will step in. One for four in the ball game. Won't catch up because it's, it's MLB. I won't catch up. Make a move for the left-hander here. Freaking hit him all. Will be the first to stand in against the new pitcher as he'll do so with the runner at first and nobody out. And he gets ahead here with the fastball. Strike one. From the belt, the pitch. Fastball, and he's quickly in the hole, 0-2. Right back, same pitch, also knee-high. He wasn't buying that one either. He's going to have to do something now. He's down two strikes. Swing and a miss as he couldn't connect on the two-seamer, and that's out number one. The second base Scooter Jeanette will try again. Two for four in the ballgame. And this is heading for the seats and out of play to the left. He's ready now. The pitch. Chopper foul. From the stretch. Still sticking with the fastball, but this time he lays off. It's one and two. He's set. Now the pitch. Off-speed pitch, and this one runs in and nearly gets him here. Sometimes if you let that changeup go too soon, it'll take off on you. He's lucky that didn't hit him. And this one's tapped foul at home plate. Here's the two and two home. I uh, had him guessing that time as he's barely able to foul it away. Another two two offering. And he strikes him out as well. So make it back to back punch outs here to the first two men he faces out of the bullpen. Anthony Rizzo will try it again. He homered back in the first inning of this one. And a fastball's in there for strike one. He's set now the pitch. He takes it to the opposite field. High oh, my God. Line. Who is this retard who's getting home runs on me? I don't even know the freaking idiot. It's a two-run shot to straightaway left. His second home run of the game as they open up a four-run lead. And the 0-1 is hit on the ground for Ibar at short. Throw on Deloney will take care of him at first, and the side is retired. Astros plate two on the two-run home run. Last chance coming up here for the Bombers. It's now a 10-6 ball game. Now here's the first pitch. Ball hit high and foul down the left field line. It's strike one. And the pitch. And a pitch in the dirt as he lays off. It's one and one. 
This man out for his second inning of work. Did a nice job getting them one, two, three last time around. Yeah, but that was against the seven, eight, nine guys. Things may be a little more difficult here now that he has to face the top three in the lineup. Now the one, two. And the fastball easy to lay off that time, two and two. The two, two. And a full count as that misses. It's three and two now. There's Eric Ibar. He'll be next. Now the three and two pitch. And a swing and a miss. Good pitch there. How was I even late on that? That's freaking dumb. Eric Ibar will stand. Come on. This game is being so freaking dumb. Final two outs. First pitch coming. Too low. One and oh. One out. Nobody on. 1 0 on the way. Not close. It's 2 0. Two well count, the pitch. Now here's the ball hit sharply toward the right side. And this will wind up a base hit for Ibar. Andrew McCutcheon will try again. Two for four in the ball game. First pitch coming. On the ground is short. Great. The second for one. On the first. Screw this game. Play ball to end it here as this ball oh my God. No wonder why I like I Madden better than MLB. I've always game. liked Madden better than this game. Goes out to pick up the rare save with this the game feels like out. having the AI win. Oh, it's going to have the AI win. Oh, yeah. There's no freaking skill involved. It's mostly random bull crap in this game. If the computers want to do good, they do good. <laughs> oh my god, I'm, I, all this game does, 70% of the time irritates the crap out of me. No wonder why this game never went sport game of the year. It's always soccer or something like that. Because this game is cheap garbage. You see there, four RBIs for him in the ball game. He came through when they needed him to, and he was instrumental in the win. Fans are final line. So that'll just about do it for us this afternoon. Thanks to Eric.